Hello and welcome to the Gripe TV. I am your host, JP Forte. Recently I had seen a commercial calling for the construction and support of the Keystone XL oil pipeline. In the commercial, they made all kinds of claims about how it would create jobs for people and how it would end America's addiction to foreign oil and how it would bring down gas prices. And as I'm sitting here and I'm watching this, I'm thinking to myself, I can't believe the kind of lengths that oil CEOs go to to try to push their agenda through and the kind of lies that they will tell to push it through. As far as the Keystone XL oil pipeline creating jobs, while it might create jobs temporarily, it will not create any kind of permanent sustainable jobs for the future. As a matter of fact, the projected time they think it will take to build and complete the construction of the Keystone XL pipeline would be about three years. So basically after people go to work on building this pipeline and after the three years of construction is complete and the pipeline is finished, what then? And not only that, but all that oil that will be run through this pipeline from Alberta, Canada, all the way down to the Gulf Coast of Mexico will not stay in this country. As a matter of fact, Americans probably will not even get one drop of that oil. What is going to happen to that oil is all that oil is going to be put in barrels, loaded onto oil tankers, and taken overseas where it will be sold in Europe and Asia because the oil CEOs will make a larger profit if they do that. So basically, America will not get one drop of that oil and the gas prices will not go down. As a matter of fact, they'll probably continue to stay up around four dollars a gallon. And the reason why is because the oil CEOs need all that extra money so they can buy off politicians and buy off whatever kind of legislation that they want that they can have passed and forced on everybody else in the country. Keep in mind people that the oil corporations are one of the big corporations that push for the Citizens United Act which grants corporate special interests the right to make all kinds of large-scale political contributions to politicians and to be able to buy whatever kind of legislation they want and have it passed regardless of whether the general public wants it or not. These people have worked to take away democracy from you and me. So what I want everybody to do is to just sit and think about this. These people went out of their way to help destroy democracy in our country. Do you really think that you can trust them or believe anything that they have to say? Now just sit and think about that. 